we currently have a strong cut of low weather system affecting South Africa. We can see it here on our satellite loop. Those thunderstorm and rain bands turning clockwise around the low, sitting over the Cape. Reports of hail on Tuesday in the Northern Cape Free States and Eastern Cape. And I can tell you now that rain band will spread eastwards overnight into Wednesday. So here's the forecast. Accumulated rainfall models are showing the showers and thunderstorms spreading eastwards on Wednesday over the rest of the Free State, moving over northwest as well as Khalteng, Pumalanga, and lots of rain expected to fall over parts of the Eastern Cape and KwaZulu Natal. Over the wild coast, more than 40 millimeters likely. If we take our model a little bit further into Thursday, it's currently picking up this black dot north of Richards Bay. In that area, close to 100 millimeters could fall throughout Thursday, but this can change. We know these types of systems are extremely fickle. This area of heavy rain could move over Richards Bay, a little bit south, or even over Durban. So we'll continue to keep a close eye on the system and give you regular updates on Fox weather. But for Wednesday, we already have a level 2 yellow warning in place for the eastern areas of the Eastern Cape, as well as KwaZulu-Natal and the adjacent interior, and a level 5 orange warning for the wild coast, as well as the extreme southern coast of KwaZulu-Natal in the vicinity of Port Shepston. Heavy rain could lead to localized flooding. Here's a rainfall probability map. Very light showers likely in the Northern Cape. More light rain for parts of the Western Cape and scattered showers and thunderstorms moving over the Free State, the Eastern Cape, later reaching KwaZulu Natal, as well as parts of Halting and the High Felt of Mpumalanga. It's a cloudy to partly cloudy day in the Western Cape with an icy southerly wind blowing. A 30% chance of a few more light showers throughout the day, but most of your Wednesday, it's going to be quite chilly with temperatures remaining below 20 and cold in Beaufort West, only 15 degrees, as well as in craft rain nets. A westerly wind for the southern coastline, partly cloudy skies with a few isolated showers still possible in the Eastern Cape. But that band of showers and thunderstorms now expected to move over the northern and eastern areas on Wednesday. An onshore flow will help to bring in more moisture, therefore heavy rain likely over Port St. John's and later Port Shepston. And then throughout your Wednesday, especially into the evening and overnight into Thursday, heavy showers and thunderstorms could lead to flooding. A few of those storms could even become severe over the eastern parts on Wednesday evening. Partly cloudy skies, a few showers around over Mpumalanga, but thunderstorms are expected to move in from the west into the evening. And then there's a partly cloudy day in Limpopo. It's the only place in South Africa where it's still going to be warm to very warm temperatures, reaching the mid to upper 20s. But that band of showers and thunderstorms moving over the eastern areas of northwest on Wednesday. It's clearing up in the west, but cold the morning temperatures in the minimum temperatures expected close to freezing minus one in sutherland a few more showers over the west and then partly cloudy skies with beautiful mid and low level cloud expected over the central and northern areas a few of them could actually bring some rain but that rain band actually stretching over the eastern areas of the free state on wednesday but it's still going to be quite cold a northerly wind for halting much colder conditions only 16 johannesburg with thunderstorms moving in from the southwest and then overnight into thursday a few severe storms likely to move over kwazulu natal we'll continue to give you updates closer to thursday and foggy in cape town on friday most of the rain clearing up it's a mainly sunny day temperatures will start to recover around 20 degrees but then we've got another front spring in light rain in the evening for cape town well, that's all from me. And remember, no matter the weather, we're in this together.